Are you looking for a good book to read? This one's really good. It's called When I Was Young in the Mountains by Cynthia Ryland. Who is Cynthia Ryland? Cynthia Ryland was born on June 6, 1954. When Cynthia was little, she lived with her grandparents in the Appalachian Mountains of West Virginia. There weren't a lot of libraries or bookstores where she lived, so Cynthia didn't spend a lot of time reading and writing. Instead, she spent a lot of time playing outdoors and making up games. When Cynthia was older, she got a job as a librarian and was surrounded by good books. Then she decided to write her own books. Good question, Moby. What does Cynthia Ryland write about? Many of her books are about experiences she went through as a kid. When I Was Young in the Mountains is about growing up in the Appalachian Mountains. The main character talks about getting water from a well, visiting the swimming hole, and going to the country store. <laughs> right. She starts each page with the line, When I was young in the mountains. Cynthia Ryland uses memories from when she was younger to help inspire her books. She's written about going to family reunions, sending valentines, and losing a family member. She's also written a few series of books. A series is a set of books about the same characters or theme, usually written by the same author. Cynthia Ryland has written tons of books starring a boy named Henry and his dog Mudge. In each book, they go on different adventures and discover new things. <laughs> kind of like you and me, Moby. She's also written a funny series of books starring Poppleton, a pig who lives in the country. Let's see. She's written a book about her own life and a book of poems, too. I guess Cynthia Ryland has written books in different genres. A genre is a type or category of writing, such as fiction, nonfiction, or poetry. How does Cynthia Ryland bring her writing to life? Night in the Country describes what the country is like at night. Her writing helps me make pictures in my mind as I read. She uses lots of details to get her message across to the reader. A detail is a piece of information that describes something. In the book, Cynthia Ryland describes the bright stars, the cool night air, hooting owls, and the thump of fruit falling from trees. You're right, Moby. Cynthia Ryland writes with the senses, like sight, sound, smell, taste, and touch. These details help readers make pictures in their mind as they read. The tall, dark trees sway in the cold night breeze, and leaves crunch beneath the feet of animals. There's nothing to be scared of, Bobby.